we've already got four in there. Let's do another one. Yeah, maybe, um, maybe. I know Brian said recently in an interview that he thinks he's done. He thinks he's done having kids. <laughs> what no, is he was like? I think. I never say never, but I think. What's your um, take on that? It's you know we're both on the same page. It's not that I wouldn't love to have more kids. It's you know I I want to be able to spend amazing quality time with Zane and of course the other kids too. You know we have three beautiful children in this house and now we've got four young kids. Mm-hmm. Uh, and we have that joke of he just you know went up to a Denali so we could all fit in the same car. If we have one more kid, we're almost at like sprinter van status, you know, or a school bus, as he says. And that's the truth. We, you know, it's not that we wouldn't love to bring another one and hopefully a girl if we do decide to do it. <laughs> hopefully, we, I mean, Brian makes boys. But we'll <laughs> exactly. yeah, yeah. Can't really roll the dice on that one. I'm not sure if we'd be able to make a girl, but we'd love to see if we could. But it is a big decision. It's a big decision to then have five young kids in the home. So we'll see. But I don't know. I'm so in love with this experience that maybe. But right now I'm four weeks out. So let's just let's just settle into this one and see let's how it goes. Let's give it a beat. Let's give it a beat. Definitely. Let's but then at that beat. point when you're like, you know, maybe like you're out of it, you're like, what's one more? Like, it totally fine. Yeah. We've already got four in there. Let's do another one. Yeah. Maybe. Um, maybe. But we'll see. We're, we're both on the, the maybe page at okay. the moment. I love that. I mean, yeah, I'm sure you, sometimes you probably feel outnumbered. There's like so much testosterone in the house. You're like, yeah, girl, like, can I get some estrogen up in here? That would be really nice. <laughs> um, is there? But I also joke. I also joke. Maybe I'm just meant to be a wolf pack mom. You know what I mean? Like maybe, maybe that's what it is. What is this past month? What kind of milestones has he hit in this past month? I mean, like you said, is he lifting his head up a little bit? How's tummy time going? I mean, what's kind of those? Is his little personality starting to creep in a little bit? <laughs> he so on day of the day of his birth, he smiled at my mum. And as soon as she held him when we got to the uh, recovery room, he's been giggling in his sleep since he was like two or three days old. He's been alert with his eyes the the whole time. It's like those big, beautiful eyes, which are Bri's eyes for sure. Um, just they, you feel like they look at you into your soul. And I'm sure every parent says this, by the way, but I feel like it really does. Um, I know his eyes are still developing, but it feels like he so sees you when he looks at you. Tummy time is going amazing. He's already incredibly strong. He is a good sleeper and a good eater, just like his parents. Uh, this kid could eat all day. Uh, at some point he's had like in the last week, I think he started like close to five ounces. Wow. Um, Great. when we're doing bottle, like I do breastfeed, it's all breast milk. Yeah. Um, that sometimes I pump so Bri can feed, but yeah, it's, he's just a, a healthy, strong growing boy. He's already over 10 pounds. You know, he came out at eight two, uh, and now he's over 10 pounds. <laughs> oh my God. He's a big baby. It yeah. sounds like he's doing great. When you and uh, Brian were deciding on Zane's name, how did you guys kind of come up with that? I love I love his name. I think it's so unique and so fun. It's cool, right? Yeah, it so is cool. We had a list of names. I also really liked the name Arrow. Uh, there was a bunch of names on that list. Mm-hmm. And it was just really in conversation over the months of being pregnant, talking and, and throwing names out there. Oh, what about this? What about that? Um, and we had a couple of really cool names, but at the kids' school, everyone has a cool name. And they were like, oh no, so and so is called that. And I was like, well, we can't have the same name as someone else. <laughs> um, but at one point, he was like, what do you think of the name Walker? And I was like, oh, I really like that. Mm-hmm. And at some point, I brought up the name Zane. And we kind of, not that we battled it out at all, but Bri's favorite name was Walker, mine was Zane, Mm -hmm. playing around with different spellings of it. And then eventually we settled on Zane Walker Green. And I I think it's perfect. I think it suits him. And we went for the Z-A-N-E spelling because it felt, um, it felt nice for us. It felt strong like Walker. Um, So yeah, well, I think it suits him. I think he got the right name. 